It's a critical factor in determining the bearer size and spacing for a New Zealand deck, but what actually is a loader dimension and how does this actually impact on your deck? This video is one of many on the Robo Deck Designer YouTube channel. I'm Paul and this YouTube channel here is all about helping you. Helping you navigate the difficult New Zealand building code regulations. I will let you know about little known clauses and design considerations that can prevent you from making mistakes and getting it right first time. But the greatest gift I can give you is the Robo Deck Designer online tool. This online tool will help you design your deck to New Zealand building code regulations within minutes. The definition of a loader dimension is actually specified in NZS 3604 under section 1.3 but this definition here is not really that clear. Um, so what it really is is actually the uh, amount of support the bearer provides in terms of a dimension along a joist for a deck. In NZS 3604 there's two diagrams there which actually show how a loader dimension actually works for a deck. There's also loader dimensions actually specified in this document in NZS 3604 for roofs, but this video here is really just dealing with just decks only. For a loader dimension, there's a few diagrams here just showing just how this actually would look for your deck depending on the number of bearers you have for your deck and if you have or haven't got an overhang. So, these diagrams here actually show quite clearly how this is actually calculated. The loader dimension is used in table 6.4 under NCDS 3604. Now this is for SG8 bearers. Now if you're using a different grade bearer like SG6 or SG10 there's also different tables there in the appendix. I hope this video has been helpful for you for understanding loader dimensions. There's also a video on this YouTube channel for joists and also one for bearers as well so it's a good idea to check these out as well. Thanks so much for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe and we'll catch you in the next one. Thanks.